Last year, these lads thought this product from Dyson was an April Fool's joke. This is either a slightly harmful April Fool's Day project or a potentially very harmful. This was an April Fool's. Oh, was this an April it Fool's? It must have been. Absolutely. Looks like the joke's on you, boys, because Dyson just released it. It's called the Dyson Zone. What is it? Well, imagine a pair of top noise-cancelling headphones went and had sex with an air purifier and wearable mask. Why is it useful? The idea is you can walk around town filtering noise and at the same time you don't have to breathe in shitty polluted air. Why I think it's good. I think it's a good concept, not gonna lie. Because I think it's pretty shit walking around town and then a big fuck-off bus drives past you and spurts diesel fumes all over your mug. Not cushy. But there's at least two things wrong with it. Number one. I can't help but feel you look a bit like a fucking Batman villain with these on. Just don't go walking around any football stadiums with these on, lads. Number two, whilst you might think that the Dyson Zone protects your ass from viruses and bacteria, the evidence I've found online suggests that it actually increases the risk of getting corona. That's because the fan inside the face covering blows air directly at your gob. The filters inside aren't fine enough to block viruses like corona. Now, is it me or after the shit show that we suffered in 2020 and 2021, wouldn't you think that any mask on my mug should aim to reduce the chance of getting a fucking disease? If if they bring back mask mandates and I've got a pair of these headphones on, does that mean I'd have to put a mask on top of that? Also, take into account the price, $949. Well lads, you lot can go and get yourselves a Dyson Zone, but this geezer is going to get himself a fucking 20 pack of N95s and save the rest for a trip to Benidorm.